Princess Catherine is juggling many hats as a woman recovering from a brutal cancer battle, being the wife of the future King of England, and the mother of three young children who need her guidance to navigate the complex journey of being part of the royal family. Princess of Wales has beaten the illness, reclaimed her rightful place as a representative of the monarchy, and has been performing royal engagements again. While dealing with a mountain of issues, Catherine attempted to play the role she has become famous for, peacemaker. The future queen had worked diligently behind the scenes for many years to restore the broken family. The Princess of Wales had some hope that she would find a way to encourage Prince William to reconcile with Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. The cancer survivor is not naive, she has not forgotten about Prince Harry and Markle's horrible confessions. However, her illness taught her specific lessons about life that she cannot ignore. Catherine understands that life is precious and family is important. For a moment after completing her chemotherapy, the princess saw a spark of hope that peace was doable. However, it was short-lived. Meghan Markle has decided to re-traumatize Princess Catherine by discussing an episode that hurt and humiliated her. Meghan Markle told the world she is the most bullied at an event in California. It was a not-so-subtle reminder that she once confessed to Oprah Winfrey that Catherine made her cry during her royal wedding to Prince Harry. It was also a way to revive the chatter that Princesses Catherine and King Charles made racist remarks about Prince Archie before he was born. Catherine, already dealing with many personal issues, has decided to wash her hands on Markle. Princess of Wales is not alone in that decision. King Charles and Prince William have declared that Prince Harry is the past and are moving onward. Royal expert Christopher Anderson shared, the royal family washed its hands of Meghan some time ago. If the royals are paying any attention to Meghan at all, this bullying complaint will only shore up the image they already have of her as a self-absorbed narcissist. Reports claim that, that Markle and Prince Harry have not entirely given up on their hope of making it work with their royal relatives. The par couple invested for $1 million in a property in Portugal, hoping to be closer to King Charles and the Waleses.